Excuse me. You're the new student in my class, aren't you? Well, Miss Popular, I would like for you to hand over your phone. You'll get it back after class. If you don't hand over your phone, I'll fail you. Or better yet, remove you from my class and you'll have to wait a whole year to take it again. <laughs> Try me. I'm not your average teacher that's going to sit here and listen to your nonsense. Now that's a good girl, learning her manners. Oh, how cute. Check it out, everyone. She has an anime boy wallpaper. Looks like I got a smelly little anime weeb in my classroom. <laughs> well, maybe next time you won't disrespect me in my classroom. <laughs> now please, take your seat before I sit you. All right, class, get your books out and go to chapter seven. We gotta pack something in that empty brain that you guys have. All right, class, I'll see you guys next Thursday. Don't forget to bring in your notes, and if you don't have any notes, copy them from your local nerd, because we will be having a pop quiz next week. You can have your phone back once everyone has left. It's not mean. You're learning patience. Something you were testing of mine today. If you were going to be such a nuisance to my class, why didn't you sit at the back and annoy someone else? Hmm? None of my business. You do know everything in this classroom is my business. This is my domain. I can do anything I want in my domain. You got that? Oh, we finally got a yes sir out of you. <laughs> Sounds like you're finally learning some manners, even if it was sarcasm. It is a start. I don't care how late it gets. I don't mind keeping you here all night. Especially if you want to keep giving me that attitude of yours. Do you want to know what else was distracting me today during my dictation? The shirt you are wearing. Do you happen to know why you were showing so much skin today? Well, it's actually very distracting. I couldn't help but avert my eyes to your chest while I was trying to do my job. <laughs> Blaming the weather. Yes, very hot indeed. You know, if you go around showing off your cleavage like that, people could get the wrong idea about you. They might call you names or even try to grope you. <laughs> Suit yourself then. Anyways, it looks like everyone has gone. I actually wanted to talk with you about something. Yes, yes, I know you want to go home, but don't worry, this will only take a second. I see your grade right here, and... Frankly, your grade in my class is terrible. Not only are you failing, but... You have the lowest grade of the class. Would you like to tell me what exactly is going on? Mmm, I see... You did it to piss off your parents. <laughs> Classic. Now go on. Oh, so now you need the A. Well, I would have to say that you are pretty much fucked. You are at a 40%, which is basically an F-. minus. Mm hmm Mm-hmm. I see... So your whole graduation walk depends on if I give you the D. Well, I could possibly give you a D, if you know what I mean. But you'll have to do something for me. 
Just a little bit of extra credit, of course.